Hello and welcome back to another flip through with coloring with Haley. I'm a little bit behind on my Deborah Muller book flip through, so I'm sure most of you have already seen this book. But I'm gonna do a flip through of it anyway. I've been waiting so long to get this book because I think it's adorable. Here is the this book belongs to page. This book has a 70s vibe to it. Like a 70s sci-fi type vibe. This girl's going into space with her cat. And here's a cat. Is it the same cat? No, this cat has three eyes. Here is an alien, well, a robot girl. Should be a robot alien. Here's another girl on a spaceship with these little worms or snakes chasing after her. Here's a girl with a scepter. Maybe she is the leader of the planet. Here's a fun picture of an alien with a bunch of different eyes. Here's another alien girl with a ray gun. Here's another alien girl with a big tail. Her shirt says Mars. I love this picture here. She is exploring some planet. She's from the United States, it looks like, from the rocket. Well, yeah, she's got a little tattoo as well. Here's a cute one. She's sitting on a big alien. This is the cover picture, I think. Yes, it is. Here is a girl with like a third eye or something, I don't know, she, or maybe she's being abducted or taking her brain. Here's a cute space girl picture. Here's another one, and these kind of have simple backgrounds, you don't have to color in this whole background if you wanted to, you could just do the planets and the stars and this little spaceship down here if you wanted. Here's another alien, she's pretty freaky. Um, her tattoo here says Mars rocks and she's got a Venus tattoo, so maybe she's on Venus. Here is another astronaut girl. Got another alien with four eyes. I like this one. I like the horns. There's a little alien girl with four eyes once again. Her shirt says I Heart New York. And this says I Wanna Believe. This picture reminds me of um, the Men in Black movie series. We've got this cool alien girl who looks like she's part praying mantis. We've got this girl who has killed an alien. Maybe she has taken over his planet. Got another cute alien girl with a tattoo that says believe and she's got some kind of little ray gun here. We've got this cute alien girl. I know she's got a little bug antenna but her ears remind me of a deer. It makes me think she's a deer. We've got another cute robot. I love robots. I think a book of from Zebra, though it's just robots, would be really cute too. We've got another alien, and she says, I believe. And she's kind of got fins on her back. We've got this girl here. She looks like a reptile. She's super cute. And I don't know what this is down here. I don't know if it's like a little onion or something, but I think it's cute. We've got this big alien girl here. Got another girl on a rocket ship blasting off somewhere. We've got another girl here on a planet and she's got a little antenna too, so she's probably an alien as well. This reminds me, like I said, it reminds me of like 60s and 70s sci-fi and the early Star Trek. I'm in love with it. This girl here is just eating a sandwich. Looks like a normal human sandwich, but she's definitely an alien because she's got four ears. This would be a fun background to do in a bunch of trippy colors. It kind of reminds me of tie-dye. We got this big alien girl here again with all the fins and the scales. A lot of these girls seem to be a little bit reptilian. And that was the last page. You guys know I love Deborah's artwork. I've been waiting for this one for so long. I've dreamed of her doing an alien book. So I'm absolutely thrilled with this one. I hope you guys enjoyed the flip through.